Hello everybody, it's Charlotte here. Welcome to a brand new video on this channel. And today's video is going to be about what you guys can read in the title. Is being transgender uh, or in the LGBT community in general a minority? To this I really say no. A lot of people say people that are in the LGBT community is a minority or people that are transgender is a minority. And here's where I debunk that. So, I didn't do any studying, so yeah, it's probably one of the worst things about this video is that I'm not going to say it. I'm, I don't have any study or like numbers, because the numbers that you guys see these days aren't really real. There is a lot of people that haven't come out as transgender, or hasn't come out as gay, or hasn't come out as bisexual, etc. They haven't come out, so a lot of these people that say, oh well, there's just this amount of people that's like this, in general, there's a lot of people I've met. As after I trans starting to my transition and coming out as to people, I'm starting to meet a lot of people that are, are going through situations where they are wondering if they should come out or how are they going to come out or all kinds of stuff. They need advice. There, there's people that are 60 years old asking me about this stuff too. Guys, it is everywhere. There's a lot of people like this. A lot of people say, well. Transgender is not really an issue because they're such a small majority of the population and I beg to differ. I think there's a lot more. I just think there's a lot of people that are just kind of like, okay, well, we're not going to come out because we're scared, you know. In some parts of the world, I'd understand because some places you can be killed for being transgender or being a part of the LGBT community in general. But if you live in America, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. I don't know why kids... And adults take this as a big thing when you say, Oh, I'm transgender. Oh, I'm gay. Blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Really, who cares? It's your life. You have kids if you want to have kids. You can marry a girl if you want to marry a girl. You can marry a guy. You can marry a guy. It doesn't matter. For instance, about five months down the before I even started transitioning, before I even knew I was transgender, I thought I was a cisgender heterosexual man that literally what it is and a lot of people are like oh you're a faggot they call me a faggot and it's funny because I'm like that's true you know I'm a girl who likes girls call me a faggot if you want to call me a faggot but these people call me a faggot because they're like you're a boy who likes boys but not all transgender people like boys that are trans girls not all trans boys like boys or transgender boys like girls it's just it's the way it is. Some of us do start off as heterosexuals at the beginning, so it's not just the amount of a guy. Why? Well, and I get this a lot. Actually, is why don't you just stay a boy if you're gonna if you still like women? And that's not even the case. Gender has nothing to do with who you're gonna like and who you're not. Most of the time, you're gonna be a boy who likes a girl, and a girl likes a boy. I understand that, but there is a good majority of people that are seeing it different ways. A lot of people are coming out nowadays and more than ever and it's not because it's a trend and if you're doing this because it's a trend you're doing the wrong thing with your life don't continue with your transition don't continue with going coming out gay and all that stuff if you're lying to yourself and lying to others that's the real problem in my situation that's that's just what I see it as if you seriously have a problem then you know, speak about it. I think that the more people that come out as gay, the more people that come out like this and that, uh, the better for the community, especially transgender people. Come out if you're like that, you know? Um, there's nothing wrong with that. Really isn't, you know? The more people that see transgender people, the more better and the more society's gonna get used to it. We don't need just celebrities coming out. We need us coming out. If you guys know what I mean by that. Anyways, yeah, being transgender and being in the LGBT community isn't really a minority. People make it look like a minority because they focus so much on numbers rather than what really happens. It's not like when I came out, someone took a documented case that I had come out and that I'm a part of that percentage. It just doesn't work that way. I don't, I don't think so unless someone really is taking tally of who's actually transgender, but there's a lot of people that don't come out so yeah it's very crazy just because you haven't seen a transgender person on the street doesn't mean that 
a lot of those people are not in their mind thinking that way or already know in their heart they are transgender they just don't want to come out there's a lot of cisgender looking people out there that actually are transgender have been transitioned or really good and passable you never know it's amazing but that's just how the world is we are all different anyways guys i'm gonna leave the video at that sorry about the whole look i like my hair though i just the makeup was just bad it's like ugh. no no nothing it's yes i still look like a boy but i think everything will get better for me yes everything will anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys did leave a like show some love subscribe go follow me on all my social links down in the description below snapchat instagram facebook you name it and my gaming channel if you are into gaming i love you guys more than anything in the world i'm charlotte you're my charlotte tears bye